Hey guys, what's going on? Aaron Bennett here. I'm excited to share this video with you. It's about Strike. Now, Strike is a platform or an app to send and receive and buy Bitcoin. I used it a few days ago. I used it yesterday. It was free to buy Bitcoin and free to send Bitcoin, and it was instantaneous. I brought it from my app, which I'll show you in just a moment. I'm going to go grab my phone to my Coinbase account. Uh, literally, it took 10 seconds to send Bitcoin. And I was blown away. I was like, how is this thing possible? So what Strike uses is the Lightning Network. And the Lightning Network is a payment channel to send Bitcoin incredibly fast, basically instantaneously for basically free. Or I think it was like 5 cents when I sent Bitcoin. It was so cheap. And uh, if you're familiar with Bitcoin, usually Bitcoin costs quite a bit of money to send. And why this app is important is this kid, Jack Mahlers, I say kid because I think he's like 27. He created this app for the El Salvadorians to start using Bitcoin. So we know that El Salvador accepted or accepts Bitcoin as legal tender. And this guy really, really helped it. The really cool part is that there's no KYC and no AML. So for people that want to stay a little bit private, this did not ask me for my license. This app did not ask me for any proof of identity. So on his Twitter, though, I just bought Bitcoin with zero fees. And that's something pretty unusual. So what I'm going to do is show you how to do this on my phone. This is my Strike app. I did a bank deposit of five bucks just to test it uh, yesterday or so. And I'm going to include a referral link below. Uh, both of us get $5 when you set up your account. You don't even need to send any Bitcoin. You just need to set up and verify your account. We both get 5 bucks. So link below. Make sure to use that to set up your account. This just works for the USA and El Salvador. So international people, I don't think this will work for you. Very sorry about that. But this is it for now. So what you would first do is go to payment methods. And you are going to have to link a bank account or a debit card. So I'm going to link my bank account. I'm not going to show you every step because it will use Plaid, which is really, really easy to use, very secure. If you don't know about Plaid, basically you pick your bank out of this list and you will log in and then it will have access to your account to do bank wires. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and then get back to you in just a second. All right. And that is it. You can see my bank account was linked. Going to click out of that. So what I'm going to do is click deposit on the bottom left. You can see the max is pretty small. It's just $100. There are ways to increase the limits. I think it's on the website, which I'll show you in just a moment after I show you how to buy and send Bitcoin. So I'm just going to do $10 of Bitcoin. I'm going to click deposit, deposit, confirm. And let's see if that goes through. Deposit successful. Very, very cool. Click that plus. Deposit was confirmed. So what I'm now going to do is pay myself. So I'm blocking out some of this stuff. These are my uh, Bitcoin transactions on Coinbase. You can see on the very top of the screen, I have $214.98 of Bitcoin. And if you click receive on Coinbase, and this works with any wallet, you will have a QR code. So what I'm going to do is click pay on my app. And then I can either send it to a username. You can see that my username was, uh, I guess it's A. Bennett, which is you know, my first name, my first initial last name. But if I go back to pay on the very top right of my phone, you can see that QR button. I'm going to click that and it's going to open up my camera. I already gave it permission to do that. So open up the camera and then I'm going to scroll right up and then it just like uh, scanned it on my computer. So I'm just going to send $5 just to show you what's up here. Um, send to the Bitcoin address, confirm. There's a six cent mining fee, so it's not free, it's six cents, but it is uh, free to buy Bitcoin. So there was no charge to buy, payment successful. There's my balance went lower. And let me refresh my page on Coinbase right here just to see if it went through, which it probably will already. And yep, that is it. So received $4.99 right now. So that happened very fast and it cost me basically nothing. So let me now go through a little bit about what Strike is and basically how it works on the website. Send money instantly with no added fees anywhere in the world. Yes, money without borders. You can send it anywhere. Buy and sell Bitcoin. Strike offers the easiest way to buy Bitcoin, skip the fees and stack sats the right way. So it says coming soon because right now, you can't actually buy Bitcoin directly on the app. 
What I did is I deposited dollars into the app and then I sent that dollars and it converted it to Bitcoin and, and went into my Coinbase account. So that's right now how you can go ahead and actually buy Bitcoin without KYC, without AML for free, other than a couple cents to send Bitcoin, way cheaper than anywhere else I've seen. So what I would suggest you do after this video is uh, download the app if you're in the States. You can use my link. Again, we're going to get five bucks each, which is pretty cool. And then here it says, uh, buy and sell Bitcoin coming soon. You can go on the website, which I'll include below, and you can enter your email to sign up for their ability to buy Bitcoin, which is going to be coming soon. So I just signed up for that ability. Uh, looks like I am very high in the position. So they're doing that same thing that BlockFi does where you get moved up the list if you refer your friends. So I will include that link below as well. So I want to talk to you a little bit more about this app and then kind of end this video. Let's go ahead and check out how does Stripe work? You deposit USD to your account and start spending or sending funds anywhere in the world. Behind the scenes, Strike will facilitate these transactions over the Bitcoin Lightning networks. So what are my limits? I know I mentioned the limits were really, really small. So users who have registered with only their email, name, and phone number have the following limits. So that's what I've done. I haven't done any other verification. You have $100 maximum per deposit, $1,000 max total deposits per week, and $100 maximum per payment. So for most people watching this, $1,000 a week max deposits, you know, most people are not buying $1,000 of Bitcoin a week who are watching these videos. Some people are, but most people are not dollar cost averaging $1,000 a week into Bitcoin. You can basically do that without giving your identity, your name, email, and phone number. I mean, you could technically use a Proton Mail email. You don't even have to use your real name and you can use a burner phone. So this is pretty cool as of now. Uh, in order to have a you know basically thousand dollar a week buying potential of Bitcoin, and you can buy it directly from a debit card or your bank. So I mean, does your bank know that you're buying Bitcoin? Yeah. I mean, are there ways around it to get a debit card? You know, you can get like a prepaid debit card that's not linked to your identity that you can use. Yeah. So you know, you can actually make this fully anonymous if you if you really wanted to. Um, but again, I wouldn't suggest that because that is not legal. So don't do that. So guys, that's it for the video. I wanted to make it short and sweet. Let me know if you have any questions below. Probably the questions about this are going to be in this FAQ section. So that's it, guys. Use the links below. The first one to get the app, you're going to get five bucks when you verify. That's pretty amazing. And the second is to, it helps me get higher in the list to buy Bitcoin using this. So that would be very helpful for me if you wanted to use that link. So thanks for watching. Till next time, talk with you soon and bye for now.